He's the man known for the famous phrase, you down with OPP, yeah, you know me. <laughs> but when life imitates reality, it doesn't always end so well. Here to discuss their relationship and road to recovery on couples therapy with Dr. Jen is Tretch and Sicily. Welcome to Arise 360. Hey, hey, hey. So you guys look like you have recovered. Yeah. We've recovered. Yes. <laughs> okay, that's a good thing. That. <laughs> Let's talk about the journey. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. And talk about the show because you guys don't need any help getting your business out to the streets and in tabloids. Mm -hmm. It's there already. We know you guys have been together for about seven years, mm -hmm. been on again, off again relationship. But why did you decide to make your personal issues public to the world on national television? Well, the best part about it was we were at a stage in our relationship where we like, you know what, it's not working and we're not trying to throw it away. What can we do to fix it? Mm -hmm. We probably need to see a therapist. And so while all this was bubbling and this was coming and different reality shows was coming to get me to and, and join in with them. And we looked at a whole different, you know, situations. Couples therapy was something that looked like it was going to help the relationship or go towards helping it. So it was like, once that came in, it was like a no-brainer. We like we definitely need to think about doing this here. Now, Cicely, what do you think your major issue was or what were your major issues? What needed fixing? Now, with me, it was definitely trust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because they're still doing 100 shows a year. Oh, okay. And he's out there. Mm -hmm. And the biggest thing for me was definitely trust. Trust. Mm -hmm. And on the show, you kind of see exactly why. You know, I should have been concerned. Mm. Yeah, because so on the show. <laughs> <laughs> Did she have a reason to be concerned, Tretch? In any woman's eyes, if you're looking for something, you will find, even if it's not what you was looking for, you'll have something that has your story at one. See, I know how to debate with women now. I know. <laughs> you better watch it because once they got in your eyes, you have to prove what you're doing and how you're doing, it's not like, okay, innocent before proven guilty. No, you're guilty at first. Now, with all the tabloids and the press and everything else, it has to... Communication was our big thing as well. And it doesn't help when your most popular song is OPP, Other People's at Property, all. talking Mr. about OPP infidelity. For life. For life. <laughs> I'm he stuck will never with that. I'm that stuck with that forever. Mr. OPP, you know? forever. Okay, Maybe so we, you should come out with a remix. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I'm just talking about stuff with Faithful the stigma. Life. Like, they can't see, like, okay, I, I have no qualms with saying I had a rock star life. I was mm -hmm. out there. I was doing things when I was young, fresh in the industry. Mm -hmm. No, I mean, it gets tiring after a while. You know what I mean? It's only so many times you want to say, okay, it ain't working. You leave. I leave. But then you have kids in the middle. It's not that simple walk-off right. anymore. It's like, who are you really here for? Is it about the family or something you have to work on? And so, you guys get pretty, I mean, it's pretty raw. I mean, you all intense. really mm -hmm. go there. Were you yeah. reluctant to expose so much? Or did you figure, since we're here, we might as well really take this seriously and let yeah. it all hang out? Everything. It was like, it wasn't just a relationship, like, rehab thing. It was like individual, like, what ghost is haunting you what was going on in your childhood so you learn things about you that you didn't know you get to see how people that our whole team in there of couples got to be best friends so when you hearing somebody else saying how you look towards them and you respect their opinion it's like wow for real mm -hmm. so then you start looking at your partner like wow i'm sorry i didn't know i looked like that sounded like that boom mm -hmm. and it's if you don't open up totally you're not going to get nothing out the therapy. Well, I've seen promos for couples therapy, and it looks like y'all did go in. I mean, you were yelling, and you cheated. No, I didn't. I don't know that girl. So tell us, <laughs> did you actually cheat? Were you ever unfaithful? No, nah, I have been totally up front with everything. She knows when go. my wild times was and everything mm -hmm. else. But it's certain things on the show I can't say where the truth was put out there, and it was seen whether it was a lie or is the truth. But I can't, I'm, I'm going to let y'all so see. Go. I'm going to let y'all see. Do you take a lie it. detector test? Well, we ain't going to tell oh. what, but it's certain oh, thing came on to see whether oh, you was. Close. Yeah. Okay. So, so okay. Tell yeah. me, girl. No. No. <laughs> September 10th, VH1. <laughs> y'all are going to see. I can't wait. So if you had to, uh, to sort of tell us in a nutshell how each of you has changed as a result of, after appearing on the show, what would you say? Cecily, what would you say about church? What would you say about Cecily? I would say about her uh, communication, mm -hmm. um, understanding. It's so good, like certain things in, in 
like with the social media and stuff will come out. She's been called my new girlfriend like three different times, so I love it. Oh. So she don't like, they <laughs> talk like, no, don't say all. Oh. They look at me like I'm out there with three different girls, but oh. it's her, three different looks. Okay. Well, I'm like, you. now, do you see what's going on? They're saying I'm out here with three different girls, but those three girls are you. Yeah. That's how you keep it fun. You know, yes. different looks. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. Uh, now, Cicely, but, how has Tretch changed as a result of... Oh, he's done a 360. Really? He's a whole new person. Mm. It's kind of like what I say all the time, Dr. Jen said, and then he was like, oh, okay. But I'm like, I always say that. But it doesn't matter. He got it. Mm. And there's so many different things that, you know, in relationships, you don't know. You bring so much, you know of a bad past relationship, yeah. of all kind of things into your relationship. The baggage. Childhood, mm -hmm. yeah. all kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. So once we got all of that out and we realized, you know what, hey, we have something, it's worth fixing, we love each other, and I mean, he's just a whole different person since we've been back. Aww. Well, we're glad you guys are in a good place now. <laughs> we'll be able to see how you got there on Couples Therapy September mm -hmm. 10th at 9 p.m. on VH1. Yes, yes. All right, we'll be looking forward to it. Thank you so much Thank for joining you. us. We'll be right back with more Rise Entertainment 360.